Greetings, y'all. It's Matt from the Green Arcade, back playing some more Farming Simulator 17. We're back here at Hagenstad. We're trying to pull this hill here. Uh, gonna go load up on uh, Sunflower and try to get that sold. I've already got one truck over there that's full. And we're gonna come back to the bakery with all of that and uh, try to go ahead and get it sold because it's at a decent price right now. 2500 I believe. We'll check it when we get there. So the days are numbered here at uh, Hagenstad. We've got four more episodes after this one. And uh, we're going to try to get to planting this episode. I need to do some harvesting. need to harvest uh, 34 and 42. Uh, i got canola up there to harvest. And uh, we still need to buy fields 12, 24, 40, and 31. Um, and we're going to have to make some money. That's why we're selling the uh, the sunflower. We've got 74000 in the bank right now. And... Um, yeah, we're going to try to make some money here, so sit back, relax, and watch the money roll on in. I wish I could do that in real life. Sit back, relax, and watch the money roll in. But uh, that's not how it works. If that was how it worked, everybody would be doing it. You have to work hard for money. Um, now, if you work really hard for money, someday you might get to sit back and watch the money roll in. But you, there's still work that's been applied to... Uh, to earn that money so all right let's cover that I'm just gonna park this over here for a minute and let this fill up while that's while that is uh, filling I'll drive that truck down to the bakery barley we got a little bit of barley in there don't we sunflower is what we want all right I'm gonna tab back over to this truck and we're gonna take this on down to the bakery now I'm going to do something a little different, a little daring, and it may be a little stupid, but I'm going to go down the mountain. I'm going to go down the mountain with this truck. I'm not going to take the road. I'm going to take the road uh, less, well, it's not the road less traveled. This is the road never traveled and never should be traveled. So, uh, yeah, don't try this at home, kids. Oh, oh, I probably went on the too steep part. I did. Let me back up. See, that's the road never traveled right there. Uh, I think I need to go down a little more. Let me go down here. Now, if you get a good running start, I bet we could jump that thing, but... Tell you what, why don't we try that? We're getting down to just a handful of episodes. It's time to start derping around a little bit. Right through there looks good. Might even do a little spin number there. Let's go all the way over to the side of this field. This is crazy. This is very stupid. I'm probably going to have to get my, uh... Well, I've got my, my tractor with the forklift on it over there, the front loader over there, so uh, I may have to call it into service here. All right, full speed. Here we go. I don't think I'm going to make it to 42, though. Oh, this is crazy, this is crazy, this is crazy. Famous last words. Will it work? Oh, no, I turned. So probably it won't work. Nope. I slowed down. Oh well. We'll still go down the mountain though. Alright. Straight down. Whoa. Oh. Ooh. Never tried that at home. And I actually made it down okay. <laughs> that was pretty decent. We'll do some more derping on the very last episode I think. We'll do have a little more fun. and I'd like to jump that. I'd like to jump off of that. Really that high point up there would be great. Whoa. Jackknife. You gotta goof off sometimes. You gotta you gotta have fun. And this might be the last time we get to do it because if they put uh, damage on the next iteration of uh, of farm sim, then uh, we won't be able to do that much. Well, I got a lot of I got a lot more sunflower up there. I got about forty thousand liters more. Let me bring that other truck up. I didn't think I had that much. Get a little run and start up this hill. Maybe I can get up it better. Got up it a little faster.
Alright, this may be the last episode I can record today. I can feel my voice starting to uh, go out here. You know, you can always tell when your voice, when you've talked too much, your voice kind of starts to hurt and sting a little bit. Yeah, mine's there. That or I'm getting the strip or something, which, you know, knock on wood, is uh, not happening. So. And then just like over on the old stream, I have got to get to planting. Uh, I think we decided uh, we were going to do uh, just a multiple crop. This time we're going to do like uh, several different types of crops. So, yeah, that's what we're going to do. We'll do corn. We'll do wheat. We'll do maybe barley. Uh, some canola, soybeans, not sugar beets, not potatoes. Sorry all you sugar beet and potato fans. Not gonna happen this time. Get this last little bit out of here. Okay, I'll go ahead and drive this down there. I'm gonna take it down the mountain too. I may take it down a steeper part of the mountain up here. Maybe I can jump it a little bit better down there. Let me try it. Let me get some speed up around this uh, this side of the field here. I know it would really work better, the Mustang, the car, because it goes over 100 miles an hour. So let me see if I can build up some speed here and keep it maintained. Try to find a spot over here where I can actually get up on the hill. That will be the next challenge. Right there looks good. See that little slope? right in there makes a perfect ramp this could be bad see I just don't think we got enough power to get over it so that's where the uh, that's where the Mustang is going to come in oh don't get stuck don't get stuck come on truck uh oh come on truck alright you know what this means Time to get the, uh, the forks. <laughs> I knew that was going to happen. See, that's why they say don't try this at home. Alright, I should be able to get it loose with this. Should be able to. Hopefully, hopefully I can. You know, just to pick it up with these forks here. And, or, they're not really forks, it's the log fork. Well, so, yeah, they are forks. Alright, now let's see if I can get this down here without getting stuck. I think if I push the trailer, like, that away. I don't know. Uh oh. Let's fix the don't get stuck. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that wouldn't be good, would it? Maybe I should try the truck. Maybe I should try pushing the truck. Don't drive off. No, 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 no. Back up. I need to hit it from this way is what I need to do. Come on, tractor, don't fail me now. Probably shouldn't have done this with a full load. That was bad thinking on my part. Or you know what I could try? I could try just disconnecting the trailer. Hey, yeah, look at that. Should have just done that to start with. Alright, let me see if I can knock it down now, maybe. Enough to where I can get up back up under it, you know. Ooh. Ooh. Not on top of it. Not on top of it. Crap. Ha! <laughs> ha! I'm making this worse. Uh, yeah. Go, 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 go. There we go. That's what I want. That's what I want. Alright. Kind of what I want. Kind of what I want, but not really. Let me... Whoa, Nelly. No, 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 no. I'm in trouble. Come on, this is supposed to be a 6x6. Six six. Start acting like it. There we go. All 
All right, now I think I can get under the front. Maybe. Well, kind of, but not really. Let me see if I can push it forward with the tractor now. This is going to be the entire episode, trying to get the uh, truck off the cliff. So yeah, I think I'm going to leave this to the Mustang um, for the last episode doing this. Leave it to... This is why you leave it to the professionals with the Mustang cars. Here we go. That should be enough to get up under it now. Okay, there it is. Alright, got it. Now, what's the best way down? Probably down around this way. and Trying to come down right over here. Yeah, this is the best way. Alright, we're not doing that again. Not with a fully loaded truck. Because if you have to reset your trailer, you lose all your grain. And I've got a full load of sunflower here and I don't want to lose it. So, we won't be doing that again with a truck. All right, we'll go get that last truck up there and uh, sell the sunflower and save that money for the fields, and we gotta buy those at some point. So, okay, last truck, and no, I am not going down the mountain. So, see, I need to put my cover on. How do I put my cover on? There we go. Unless I go back down the same spot that I did go down the first time and not that other spot. Because I got stuck on the other spot, technically. So I could go down this spot again if I did it right. So I'll come down here. Come up the smooth spot. And drive this way. Yes. And go over here. If I can make it. And go down right here. Is this where I went down? Yeah, this is it. Because there's a smooth spot down here at the bottom. So yeah, that's a little bit quicker than going around the long ways, but uh, not at all realistic. And there's my tractor up on the cliff. And magically, it disappears. Watch, watch, it's going to disappear. Magic, 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 come on, magic. Make it disappear. Disappeared! Woohoo! It's a kind of magic. Alright. So, we're here at the bakery. We're gonna check the prices again. Twenty-five thirty-six for Sunflower, that's the highest price. Transport Company has the next highest price down there. Uh, so, we're gonna go ahead and sell the rest of this uh, Sunflower. See, I'm going to have to start these up. Well, the tab order has it all messed up. I took the yellow one up there for the canola, so let's go ahead and sell. 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 Try to make a little bit of money off of this stuff. Can't really beat the price. I mean, it is a green price, so... Maybe we'll make enough money to uh, buy a few fields. And uh, now we're just watching the soybean price. Uh, it is going up at the bakery, but uh, gonna have to keep an eye on it. It's still in the red. All right, let's uh, find our planters, I guess. This is one of them. We are going to start planting some crops. Now I'm thinking uh, field one, I kind of want to do in soybeans. So I think this will pull that, but this bigger tractor would probably be better on the bigger one. Boy, it needs to be washed too. Let me run over here and wash this real quick. And wash. Wash it. Need to wash it. 
Wash it. That sounds like I'm really struggling to say it. it sounds like I'm a Bostonian from uh, the Northeast. I need to wash it. I can take my khakis down to the yard, park the car, and I'm gonna mow my yard. That's my best Boston accent. I can't do any better than that. Alright. Moving on to the Brent. Wouldn't it be cool if you had like a drive through car wash you could run this through? That'd be pretty neat. Just drive it through it and it had like the little spin scrubber things and had a little animation for that. That'd be neat. Alright. I'm just going to park this over, I think, by the chickens here. Right here looks good. Because we will be using it at some point in the future. I'm going to back in here and get this big planter. Uh, where, don't we have another cultivator? Or do we on this map? I don't remember. Well, I'll probably do the small fields with the cultivator anyway, so I'll put that little puma on there. Right now, I want to get this down to uh, field one, I think. Get it planted in soybeans. Let's see, field one is actually this way. I should have took the other drive out of here. Should we do some derping with our planting machines too? Let's do it. Let's take the road less traveled. Or I say the road, it's the road never traveled. We'll take the road never traveled. And over here, that is gonna be uh, up here, maybe somewhere. I'm gonna say right over here. Doesn't look very steep. I think uh, maybe this is where field one comes out at. Yeah, it looks like the edge of field one right here, so. Ooh, it is a little bumpy though. Uh, which way? I need to go down this way, don't I? Oh, don't get stuck. Whoa, that planter's kind of whipping around there. Coming down the mountain when it comes. Alright. Okay, so we did good. We did good. We got fur, we got soybeans, we're gonna start planting here. Alright, so we're planting soybeans in field one. So we'll leave that to it. We'll tab back over to this tractor. Uh, I'm gonna be planting probably some wheat. We need to plant some wheat somewhere here, so. Okay, down here, I think I want to do corn over in 14, 15, and 16, and wheat over in 17, 18, and 19. So I'm going to get this guy going over here. So let me change that to wheat. I know these are big fields, but I kind of like having wheat and corn right here by the homestead, so. I'm going to plant some wheat over here. I'll probably have to come back and plant some on this edge up here that it keeps missing. Alright, so that is planting. Let me go get my little tractor wherever it's at. There it is. See if I can get it off this mountain. And I'm going to take this little guy and put it on the cultivator and uh, go find some small fields like uh, well I guess I could put it on 14, 15, and 16 I'm gonna have to cultivate that for corn in anyway so I'll get him down there let him start cultivating really I need another cultivator but I can't get a big one now actually I could get a big one I could put this on the planter, on the corn planter, and put the big blue tractor on uh, the cultivator. 
So let me go sell that cultivator, and I'm gonna go get another big one, a bigger one, not a big, big, not a big, big one, but a bigger one. All right, there's the cultivator. So let me drop this weight. Tell you what, I'm gonna drop this uh, log fork too. I don't really need it on there while I'm doing this. So let me grab the cultivator. Hopefully I've got enough front weight with these uh, arms on there. Yeah, I'm not skating around too bad. Uh, I am skating around a little. Probably need a front weight. I don't think I have any back at the homestead. I think I got them all on uh, tractors and stuff. So let me get a front weight too while I'm here. All right, let me sell that. Sell it. And I think I'm just going to lease a uh, cultivator. A decent size one. I like this one. It doesn't require a lot of horsepower, so... We'll get that one. I'm just going to lease it. Because I only need to cultivate this last time. Oh, and we need a weight. I'll buy a weight. They're not that expensive. 1500 Echo. Color black. Okay. Whoa. The thing is a rocking. Y'all see that? Whoa. I don't know why that thing's rocking. When the house is rocking, don't bother knocking. R.I.P. Stevie Ray Vaughan. That's Stevie Ray Vaughan, right? When the house is rocking, don't come knocking. Yeah. That's Stevie Ray Vaughan. Alright, gonna have a little extra time here in this episode, but I want to get all this stuff started, so... We're putting it off long enough. Alrighty. So now let me tab to the blue tractor, which is up here by the mill. Bring it back home. Switch it over to corn. And I'll put this tractor on the cultivator and this one on the... Um, Mmm, the corn planter. The red one on the corn planter. Alright, let's take a shortcut. We've been doing it all episode, might as well do it here too. Boy, this is a... Ooh, that's a steeper shortcut. That's a steeper shortcut. There's a tree. Oh. Sorry. Hit the tree. Alright, but I did make good time. So... Good job. All right, I'm gonna drop this right here. Go over and get this cultivator and get it rolling. I don't know if I have enough room to get in here. Almost don't. I think I can get it though. All right, let's get this over here and get it going. I think this tractor will pull this. I hope it will. I think it's got 350 uh, horsepower under the hood. It's got 313, and this really takes 350 I think so this should be interesting will it let me do it it may still pull it oh yeah that'll work that'll work just fine alright guys so we've got the planters going gonna get the corn planter going as, as soon as this guy makes a few passes let him get ahead a little bit and uh, we're gonna start planting our crops here and in the meantime we're going to uh, watch those other fields and uh, hopefully they will uh, grow and uh, we can buy them and plant them as well or just harvest whatever they have in them so until next time remember you reap what you sow it's matt from the grain arcade we will see you guys later